beautifuls. I'm just Jackie is here. I'm here. I'm back. Oh, I, I hate when I say I'm back. I'm, I'm, I'm not gone. I'm just, you know, not here on a regular basis. So anyway, happy freaking new year, beautifuls. This is my first video of 2020. Um, yeah, I wish I could have brought you guys something sooner, but listen, Life happens. I ain't making no excuses. Whoever's been rocking with me this long, y'all already know. And for whoever's watching my video for the first time, welcome to my channel. Click that beautiful red bell that says subscribe. And come enjoy the ride with I'm Just Jackie. I give you a lot of stuff. I give you personal me. I give you the girl who loves to play in makeup. That's what we're going to do today. I give you the girl who likes to talk about her natural hair. I have not given you guys an update, but y'all see what's popping right now? Okay. Let me know if you want a uh, hair update video. You know, I try. I try, beautifuls. I try. Just keep working with me. And I got you. But anyway, long story short, short story long, I went on and broke down and bought some Juvia Place. Yes, I know all the drama drama behind Juvia Place. Yes, I boycotted uh, Juvia Place um, for the longest time. The only, the only thing I ever had from Juvia's Place was this. This. Okay. And I really didn't pull for it too much, but um, everybody knows why everybody's boycotted um, Juvia's place. I'm sorry for the camera bounce. I'm trying to get comfortable, and I got my feet up on the table and stuff. So anyway, everybody knows why the boycott is popping. Everybody knows why it's even more drama now. I'm not even getting into the shits. I don't care. This is the this is the resolve for me. Now, whatever y'all do with it, y'all do with it. This is the resolve for me. Because my thing is, it's so many other companies out there who are owned by white America, black America, whoever, any kind of America, all types of origins, backgrounds. Basically, what I'm saying is, as soon as our people of color do something outlandish, uh, whatever, disrespectful, or whatever, we cut our own culture off. We cut our own culture's hand off, okay? Y'all are still out there buying all these other goddamn products by all these other uh, people who probably are a little racist or what have you or whatever, but y'all still buying their products. Y'all ain't boycotting. Y'all still out there buying Michael Kors. Y'all still out there buying all these high-end shits, you know, from these people who are who have been known to say racist, racist ass slander shit. Okay, so why are we so quick to jump the jump to the gun? And as soon as our people don't don't stand up or don't say nothing or quiet or whatever, we over here choosing sides. We over here boycotting and shit. Okay, one more thing before I get into this damn all oh, whatevers. One more example. Shea Moisture. We boycotted the fuck out of Shea Moisture just because of that ad. I, listen, I'm not condoning shit, okay? But what I'm not going to condone anymore is how we are not cutting all other cultures off when they fuck up. Y'all still out there buying H&M, right? Ain't y'all still out there buying H&M? Did you boycott H&M? So we so quick to boycott our own culture and cut our own culture's hand off instead of standing behind them and continuing to support them, voicing our concerns to let them know, like, hey, this is our concern. Give them a chance to clean it up. Y'all, we, we wasn't even giving them a chance to clean nothing up. We was in the uproar because we saw this white man use their makeup and they reposted it. And we know this white man is a known racist. So are y'all I know some of y'all are out there boycotting this this white man. But some of y'all ain't boycotting this white man. But y'all ain't fucking with Juvia's place because of this. So I'm I'm just over picking and choosing these battles. I'm not I'm not part of this battle. All I'm saying is I'm just gonna support my peoples the best way I can. The best way I can support Juvia's place is make my concerns vocal and if I like the product, I'm going to buy the product. I'm not going to not buy the product because they didn't uh, do the campaign right. Or they're catering more to another culture than our culture. 
God damn it, everybody caters more to the other cultures than our culture. So let's just stop with the shits. And let me get into this motherfucking video. Either you can stop playing right now or y'all can sit here and hang with I'm Just Jackie. So for who don't know, y'all know Jackie can get long-winded. And that's what I do. So anyway, today I want to give you guys a Juvia's Place face. I probably should have already did the brows and shit. But li listen, I did prime. But I did, I'm not using no, um, what do you call it? I'm not, I'm not doing no color correcting or nothing today. I just want y'all to see how this makeup looks on me. So I will share everything that I purchased though. But I probably won't be using everything today. Because I just don't know how... How serious I want to do this face. So it's kind of like a. I'm just going to do a face and I'm just going to tell you about the product and how I feel about the product because I had these products for a while. I just hadn't gotten to the point where I was at the point of making a video for my beautifuls. Okay. So at the end of the day, I did get the foundation, right? Got the foundation. The color I'm going to use today is 205, if I'm not mistaken. 205. But I also have this one. Um, is that right? I think I'm going to take this one back. I hope it ain't too... Eh, I, I don't know what I can do. Maybe I can exchange to get a credit. I don't know. But this one's 210. This is Togo. Togo was a no-go for me. You know. So I'm just going to... I don't need that much. This is Togo. And I'm just going to put it right here on my chest. Togo. Way, way darker than what I expected. But, I mean, you know, just way darker than what I expected. Um, it's a no-go. Um, the one I'm putting on today is... Oh. Oof. I wish I, I... I know I got my magnifying glass in the other room. This one is... Tanzania, Tanzania, I don't know, but this is the one I'm using today, okay, this is the color I'm going with today, now if I do decide to keep, um, or if I can't take her back or whatever, um, because I know it's been more than 30 days, I, I can't remember, um, I can't remember that policy, Ulta's, Ulta's policy, but I can, honestly, I can get away with using 210 for a contour, you know, contour, so, but yeah, I'm using, um, Tanzania, I hope I'm pronouncing it right, whatever, so that's what I want to put on today, and you know what, I have, I'm so over myself, like, y'all, I literally lined up all our brushes right here, and the brush that I want to use, I do not see it. And this is like my favorite foundation brush at the moment. Like this works good for. Damn, I don't know where it is. This it works good for this, but oh god. Let me find another one to use. I don't want that one either. Like, why you can't find? And as soon as I like finish this video, it's gonna be like right in my damn face, y'all. Right in my damn face. It's probably right in my damn face right now. But. I don't see it. So anyway, um, I'm gonna go with this one. This ain't the one I wanted, but this one's also good for found, um, foundation too. So I'm just gonna put a little on my hand, right up here, a little bit on my hand, little glop, little dollop. But y'all can see like it's a no. That two ten is two dot, and you see this one's kind of we here. So we're gonna make this work right. If y'all see me staring over here, I am in my handy dandy mirror. And the reason why I'm not doing any um, color correcting is because I just want to see, I want you guys to see the coverage, like the coverage of this foundation because that's what really um, navigated me to want to try this so bad. I watched so many videos on YouTube from the popular YouTubers and not even not just popular YouTube all everybody whoever popped up in my feed cuz you know how YouTube do when they see you watch a bunch of videos they'll start throwing that stuff in your uh, to watch list or whatever so that's what I did and everything so I was just watching 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 and I was like I don't care what nobody say I said I'm gonna try this um 
Juvia's place. I am. And it's like I just wanna I just wanna try it. Because it looks like skin. And and it feels good too. Cause I've been wearing this for a while, y'all. I've been wearing this for a while, but not every day, because I don't y'all. I don't wear makeup every day no more. And I think that's the reason why it takes me forever to come and give you guys a video, you know, because I really got to be like in the mood to to do this shit anymore. Um, now that I don't love YouTube, I still love YouTube, but y'all, it just takes a lot to come up here and I'm just going to cover the eyes too and give you guys these videos anymore. Um, first of all, it's tax season, y'all. It's tax season. So y'all know between New Year and end of April, because, you know, people come at the deadline. People still try to push their tax. People still try to get their taxes done even though the deadline is gone. So I always say January through April. It's a hard time for me because I just be so busy, all right, and uh, with taxes. And honest, and I just shit, y'all. The year, the we we in February. The tax season started officially, officially started January 28th this year, if I'm not mistaken. I believe that was the date. I'm not doing no brows, y'all. I ain't doing shit. <laughs> y'all going to get what I do because I'm just not doing this full face shit, y'all. I can't. All right, so this is what the 210 look like, y'all. Two, I mean, I 210. 205. So this is 205. That's what it look like on my hand. Plus, blah, 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 boom. That bad, that bad. It, you know, my yes, my chest area is lighter, but look at the neck, bitches. Look at the neck, neck, neck is in check, y'all. Neck, that's what matters. I have not been out in the sun. I ain't do much this summer. I ain't getting no color, so my chest is lighter than a bit. Okay, so we here. So I'm just putting on. I do like this real tech. These brushes, it's, it's a soft brush, and it's just good for putting on your foundation. And spread it in around and getting it even everywhere. All right, I like this brush, but it was another one I like too. It's a real techniques. It's got the cow print, and that's also a good face brush. But I can't find it. But whatever. I told you I'm gonna find it when this video is over. So, yeah, that's the foundation. I'm not doing no brows, y'all. I swear to goodness, I ain't doing no brows. I just I ain't in the mood for the brows. I just said I won't do no brow. But let me just put a tail on. At least let me put a tail on. Okay. Yeah, I know this is my handy dandy favorite. Alright. Just a little bit. I'm just going to fill it in a little bit. We ain't going to go hard. I just said I ain't gonna do no brows, bitches. I'm up here doing somebody. Listen, I, somebody I don't know who it was, but some. Oh, I was doing a podcast. Somebody said the one thing I have to have done, and I said my brows. Like, why not? Why not? And normally when I'm doing a face face, y'all, yes, I have the the little reddish burgundy pencil to, but no, not doing that today. Okay. The struggle is real. So, again, tax season, I be struggling. And I'm be honest with you guys, I be fighting depression. And that, that, that's just the black-ass bottom line. I be fighting depression. That's another reason why I just haven't um, been very, very consistent with um, just being up here for my beautifuls. All right, y'all. So, I told y'all I got the foundations right. So, I got the foundations. So, what y'all think? What y'all think? What y'all thinking about this color? Keep it 100. What y'all think about the color? Okay, so I also got foundation sticks, okay? So the two that I got are Cameron, is that right? Cameroon, Cameroon. So I'm just going to swatch it, Cameroon. Like when I really don't feel like doing a face and I don't feel like messing with no liquid foundation. Okay, so let me just, hold on, let me get my life right, right here. All right, that's Cameroon. Can y'all see that? And then I'm gonna. This is the one I use for my overall face. Um, baby, a pigeon, a pigeon. I don't know, but I'm gonna swatch right next to it. That's the one I really use for my my face. So like, here's the thing. Like, 
I was going to take this one back too, but honestly, I can still use this for a contour if I want to because it's dark enough, you know, for me to use for a contour. I can get away with using it on my face, but what I do is I will take the, the what is it, Abigan, and I will do it on the, um, the outer part. Is it the outer part? So I'll use it on the center of my face, and then I will use this on the outer part and kind of blend it together. And get, you get a whole different color. You still kind of maybe one day I'll show y'all how to do it. But whatever, listen, that's what I do, and it, it just it works just fine. Okay, so I'm not using those sticks today, but I will tell you the sticks are are good too. Um, I like the they're just very convenient. It's very quick and simple. You don't waste no makeup because it's just like boom, 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 boom. And it blends effortlessly. I will say, in my opinion, the sticks uh, secrete more oils on my face than the, the liquid foundation. I, you know, I don't know the difference in the formula or nothing. But not in a bad way, y'all. Not in a bad way. I just noticed that it was more shine with you know with the sticks all right so but they are dope and I, I can't remember how much this stuff costs i think the foundation was 20 i think the sticks are 15 right right now i got concealers i got two concealers i got one for the under eye and then i got this one this one i was going to definitely use, i used it for contour but baby i'm telling y'all y'all do not need a lot of this for no contour. I'm actually going to use it for the contour to show y'all, but I really don't want to. I'm going to keep it a buck. I really don't want to, but I'm going to do it. But I'm also going to go ahead and do this concealer, um, the highlight, okay? Look at look at all that shit on my chest and shit, y'all. Look at that. Look at this shit. So, And y'all notice that stick is so much redder, too. So these are supposed to be in the family of the liquids, but... It's just, yeah, they both work. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying. This one would probably be, this one would probably be the one I would use more. Yeah. And I would use this one in the center. Eh, whatever. Who knows? But anyway, let's get this, uh, let's get this highlight popping. This is a nice, um, this this concealer is nice, right? Y'all say, God damn, it's bright in the bitch. Bright in the bitch. I, Jack, you're supposed to go like one or two shades lighter than your skin. Correct. Okay? But what I'm saying is, let me just swatch this motherfucker on my hand. Okay? I'm just saying. So, work with me. Once you... I, the thing is, yes, it's super light when you put it on, but... You got the foundation under it, and by the time you finish blending, I really just, I'm just going to do a little bit, y'all. I told y'all I ain't want to do no whole goddamn face. I don't want to do no whole goddamn face. I'm not. I refuse to do a whole goddamn face. So. Okay. So watch, just, just, just watch, y'all. Just watch the difference in the color. Watch. I ain't no makeup artist. I'm just a makeup enthusiast, okay? That's all I am. You go pitter pat, pitter pat. Sometimes I just don't want to do that big. But I'm going to do it today because we're doing this video. Sometimes I just go right up under the eye and go like an inch under the eye and that's it but I'm going to give y'all this Kim K um highlight today okay that's what I'm going to give y'all today and but it's really nice it's smooth smooth it's smooth uh if anybody who really knows me, y'all know my favorite ass highlight. My concealer I like to use the contour with. And <sighs> my thing is not going to say it's better than my favorite, but it has the potential to be. And when I say the potential to be, it depends on 
what finishing powder you use. Look. Let's try to blow. I just got it all up in here. If you do it right, you can just get your natural contour with your nose. But, um, Whoa. oh, that was so rude. I kind of forgot I was on camera. <laughs> I, I did. I forgot I was on camera. So, anyway, um, yeah, I'm just blending, y'all. Y'all know blended is the key. Uh, and I always come up at an angle because it cut let y'all learn these goddamn tricks of the trade. You hear me? Do it at a slight little angle when you're doing your um highlight and it narrows your face. If that's what if that's the look you're going for. You know what I'm saying? By the time you finish contouring and all that stuff, is try it. Try it. That's all I got. Try it. Alright, so let me finish. And then let me just take the round right part and kind of just blend it so it won't be no harsh line. In between, and then let me do it up here as well. Uh, gotta be careful with that forehead. Yeah. All right. So, but the kiss, the concealer is nice. Let me tell you what color I have here. This color is number fourteen. And but see how they so bright no more. Like it blends in good with the um. With the foundation, it gives you the right amount of poof. Not that knock your ass out, Kim K, you know, brightness, you know, but see, it goes from boom. All right. So now, I did get the um the powder. What's it called? They call it Kalahari. I am magic setting powder. So I did get the setting powder. Um, Y'all know my go-to setting powder. So I'm not a... Hey, I, I'm, I'm up for trying new things. So I said, let me try this. I love the color. It's a nice, pretty... Can we focus on it, though? Can we focus? It's like a banana. Banana. A little bit more... A um, little bit more golden than... Yeah, a little bit more golden than the, than the Sasha. You know what I'm saying? So, whew. I'm going to take a little bit. I'm not baking, y'all. I ain't baking. I ain't baking. What I do is I pitter-pat. I'm in the mirror, too, y'all, because it's hard with looking at this camera sometimes, too. I pitter-pat. Get all of it. No baking. No baking, y'all. And I just make sure I get it all. Make sure I get it all. Because I'm not doing no bacon. No more bacon for Jackie. Not really. I don't really bake no more. So what I do is all areas I set with that powder, I make sure I get it good. I get it good. Get the forehead. It's like I'm just pressing it in. That's basically what I'm doing. Pressing it in. I miss coming up here on a regular basis with YouTube. And I've been trying to get back into watching it and stuff. But y'all, I don't, I don't know. Life just... Sometimes shit happens in your life and it just alters you. So... <sighs> I mean, y'all watch my life after 40. I've pretty much been real honest and open about the changes that I've been going through in life and stuff. And it has altered me tremendously. All right. So that's it. That's it. That's all I'm doing. That's all I'm doing. I like the powder, but it's it's definitely not a fave. It's okay. It's okay. It's not a, it's not a fave, y'all. I'm just not even going to try to fake the phone. You can do without this. I love my Sasha. But I'm going to make this work. Make it work. It kind of gives me ashy. I don't know. Like, ashy dry. I, I got nothing. I, I don't know. But I, I just ain't a big ass fan of it. That's all I got. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and take this. Is this the one I want? 
Let me see. I don't remember which one it was. What's it? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and take this on. No, I told y'all. All right, I told y'all I was going to use this. I'm sorry. I'm going to use this, y'all. Okay. All right, this is the number number two. All right? Number two, and she is dark. See how dark that is? I don't even want it this dark, but I'm telling you, watch. 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 Serious. I remember the first time I did this, and I was like, oh, no, I didn't need all that. Look. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm looking at this goddamn Apple Watch to get these messages covered in. They're just ridiculous. All right, so I'm going to do my little fish face. I'm just going to do two dots. And that was the this one. Y'all. Oh, hold on. I just really don't want to do it. Listen, y'all. I just listen. Let me just. Ooh, I don't even know if I wanna. I don't really want to. What's it? I'm just gonna put that here. If you don't, I don't even need all this bitch. I'm telling you. What's it? Cause um, bitch. I probably did too much. What I'm telling you, the pigment ain't no joke, bitches. This is what I'm telling you, that is no joke. Okay? All right, so let's just go. Let's just go. See that? Like this. We'll come up a little bit. Blend. I'm telling y'all, don't need much. I'm telling you, blend it some more. What y'all been up to though? Cause y'all know, like, I ain't even say y'all. Listen, y'all know when I'm not up on um YouTube. Like, I used to be up on IG posting every day. I don't even be on IG posting every day no more. I, I literally just changed. I just, my normal is not normal anymore. Or was that even normal? You know? Like, I, I talked about it in one of my Life After 40 videos. I felt like I was just putting on this fake-ass face every day, coming up here doing my How Beautiful videos. Because that's what you guys expected. At so, at, at a certain point, people just expected me to come up and do these videos every morning. And I was really lying to myself. I really wasn't in that happy place, happy space, happy face that you guys saw every morning. But it, I, I am now. I am now. I am now. I'm just saying it drained me. And I guess I'm still trying to recharge and refuel. But y'all, look at this shit. Look at that shit. Remember the dot was bigger on this side? This side? Listen. I'm telling y'all. Listen. Let me get my life. Let me get my life. Just You just need a little teeny dot. Now I got to work harder to blend this side. Because it was more than what was on this side. Listen. <laughs> Listen. Listen, we good. We about to, it's about to be what it is, y'all know what I'm saying? Shit, Jackie ain't got time for this. I ain't got time, but I'm going to work it out. I'm going to work it out. All right, so now we're going to do this right here. Go hit this nose. <sighs> See how dark it is, though? Baby, don't worry about it. <sighs> Jackie going to clean all that up. Y'all ain't going to worry about it. Look at that. You don't look two dots would have got you. I put three. You didn't even need the three dots. I'm telling you. The pigmentation on this goddamn concealers. Ain't no joke. Ain't no joke. Alright, so. Mm. I didn't do the I'm gonna just do a little forehead, little forehead. See, I did too much. I ain't even wanted on that. Look at that. Let me just go here. Girl. Girl. I ain't gonna do all that. Listen. But yeah. Girls. And boys. I'm telling you. 
the pigmentation on this is off the fucking chain. Off the chain. So I'm just trying to blend it in up in the hairline. All right, so I know y'all some. I know some of y'all saying Jackie. It looks harsh. It looks harsh. You probably right. Probably does look harsh. But you know what I'm about to do. You know what I'm about to do. Oh, you know that. God damn it, y'all. Oh, so mad. Anyway, so what I at y'all know what you do when you're using a liquid or or cream for your. For your contour, come back with a powder. So, we all ready? My favorite shit right here. This is my favorite shit. This is my favorite shit. I love it. And you just rub it on, rub it. Blend and rub. Rub it up, dub. With that chin. And get you some gin. <laughs> I ain't got no sense, y'all. I don't need to know why y'all come up here and watch my shits on this video. None whatsoever. So anyway. Let me see what this natural sunlight going to give me. Ooh. All right. Natural sunlight in the house. All right. So let me just, you know, work it out. Work it out. Hit that nose again. Chin. All right. That's that. Y'all can see how tired I am. See my eyes are sunken. Now, once I do that, I come back with my Tux and Caicos. I love to. I love the bronze. I love the contour. If y'all ain't figured that out yet, and it just brings it all together. Brings it all together. Hit that forehead up here. Hit that forehead up here. Mm-hmm. All up under the chin area. Get that no. Boom. All right. So now what I really want. What they really want. Some eyeliner. But I don't have my purse with me. And my eyeliner is in the purse. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take some black eyeshadow from the Naked Palette. And just do it under my eyes real quick. And um, ooh, I'm being rude in this video. I'm sorry for the belching, you guys. And then just go like this. Um, Hit that waterline. Cause really, this was supposed to be a Juvia's Place face, but I'm not doing no eyeshadow, none of that stuff. I really just wanted to come up here and talk to you about the foundation and the concealer. And, and show you how I've been using it. Obviously, I've been using the concealer for um come on, focus. Obviously, I've been using the concealer for um, contouring, you know, concealing, I guess, whatever. Con concealing is what. No, I've really been using it for concealing. Just been using it for contour. Um, I do, Lord, I do like the, uh, I'm in my mirror, y'all. I do like the, the stick foundation. Um, the stick foundation is, is convenient. Um. Color wise, the the liquid foundation is better. I, I found I found my selection in the liquid foundation color is better than my selection in um the stick. Even though it's supposed to be like the same, you know, the same family, same kingdom, if that's what y'all want to call it. All right, so that's that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, I don't have no mat. Where's my mascara? Look, y'all, I ain't got no mascara. I ain't got nothing. So at the end of the day, let me do my face powder. Oh man, I didn't do man, Jackie effing up. I all my stuff is in my purse. I don't know what I was thinking. 
I'm gonna uh, I like to finish it off with my Mac but I don't have it um I did oh I, I'm tripping I'm tripping I did get a blush I was thinking I didn't get a blush but I did get a blush so the blush I got was I'm trying to see the name okay the blush I got is Afrique 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 blush I don't know but it's this one okay Zoom, 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 and the boom, boom. There we go. Serafina. I got Serafina. And, um, it's like a, hmm, it's like a mauve pinkish thingy. So I'm just gonna be careful. Because you see all this on the brush? I forgot. I haven't used it in a while. I forgot how, yeah. So I'm gonna blow some of this off. Mm. And that's how I do it. I do it like this at first. Cause I know I got too much on this goddamn brush. But, and I'm just gonna go like this. See? And then I'm gonna cut. I, I love blush. So then I just come and just go like this. And I come up with it. Just like I come up at the angle with my um with my under eye highlight. So this is how I do my blush. It's kind of like blending the contour and everything. Okay. It's very light, doesn't show too tough, but it also has like a shimmer, kind of, sort of, kind of shimmer, kind of, sort of, you know, but um, it do what it do, it do what it do, and then, yeah, I just dust it, like so, yeah, that's what I do. So that's the blush. Like I said, not to. It's very. It's, it, I don't think it shows up on my skin pretty good. But to keep a natural looking face, it's a cool. It's a cool. It's a cool blush. Um, it's a cool blush to keep a natural looking face. Now I'm gonna finish off my face. I'm mad because this is not the finishing one I wanted to use. I wanted to use my MSF, but it's downstairs. So I'm gonna use the. Estee Lauder Double Wear to finish off. I don't even know why I'm, I'm tripping. I'm using that. And I just go like this. I pat it on. All over. Get my chin I really want to mind. MSF because it's got a redder undertone and it just warms my whole face up. This one don't got no red undertone for real. This one's more like a yellow undertone. It's like a cool undertone for the winter. And yes, we are in the winter, but I still wanted my MSF to warm my face up a little bit. But um, I'm just going to come back with the bronzer and just go around the just to warm up my face a little bit because I feel like it's not as warm as I like it. That's up. Alright, that's that. I ain't got no mascara because my mascara is downstairs in my purse. And I'm just going to hit you guys with a little nude lip. A little pinky nude lip. From Ulta. Just trying to see which one I want to use. I'm going to go with this mauve. Nice little mauve color. Yeah, cool. And you know what else I can do? I could take my. Hmm. Y'all. I hate not having nothing in my face. That's not what I want. It's like I've seen everything before I hit record. All right, let me see. let me just do this. All right, I was looking for my um my Vino, my Mac Vino, but I ain't see it, so I got this one. This Nakia K. This is really the one I use for my brows. You know, 
to put the um the burgundy in my brows, but I just wanted to line these lips a little bit. And here we go. Hi y'all. That is it. That is my Juvia's Place face. Oh, I'm lying. I got one more thing, y'all. I did get a highlight. I did get a highlight. Focus camera. Okay. Got a highlight, y'all. So I'm going to throw that on real quick. I wonder why I cannot find... You know how you got certain favorite brushes for certain things? Yeah, I have a highlight brush that I love. It must be in my purse. I don't know. But let me just put it on my... I don't even know if y'all can see it. I just swatched it right here on my hand. So it's not really... It's cool. But I'm just putting it on because, like I said, Juvia's Place Fresh. Yeah. yeah. Now I got to... And then, come on, this side, do the same thing. I'm in my mirror too, y'all. It's just, I'm not a fan of this highlight. The color's pretty, but, eh, I'm not a fan of it, so. But anyway, I can do without the highlight. All right, y'all, so, beautifuls. Liquid foundation is definitely worth the $20 you, you're going to pay for it. I love it because it's tiny. And then, like, when I travel, when I go out of town, I'll be traveling. And this will be one of the one of the foundations I take with me. Um, the sticks are great. They're convenient. You can use it for contouring as well. You know, uh, whatever your poison is, pick your poison. Boom. Uh, trying to find your color is not really hard either because on the what because I I went on the Juvia's Place website first and then I did the little color testing and whatever whatever then I ordered from Ulta because I wanted my points okay and plus the Ulta was having a, a nice ass sale on Juvia's Place so anyway so you could definitely find your color through the website it is really it's really decent I think the color choices that they suggested for me are really good um. Yeah, here we are. Here's, let me get it close. I didn't even get it close. So, here's the face. No color correction. I feel like I got a beard. I feel like I got a 5 o'clock shadow, bitches. But it is what it is because I like. I feel like I got to, you know, color correct around my mouth around here, this area. But anyway, but yeah, so just looking in the mirror, it looks decent. And then, like I said, the color, like, y'all saw it from the beginning to now. Look at the color. You know, working with it, working with it. Look at all the, the shades and stuff on my chest. Do I recommend Juvia's Place? Yeah, I recommend it because you're going to get, uh, you definitely going to get your money's worth. Definitely try the foundation. Definitely try the, try the foundation sticks. Definitely get to concealers. Um, even though I did not use any of the two eyeshadow palettes that I do on uh, this one, I really like, I like this one more. You know, I do like this one. Um, but, they are good. The color payout is 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 yummy. Um, the price points are really good. I actually got this one from Ulta. It was on sale. Uh, I was with Petrina one day, and I think it was like eight dollars or something. I, I mean, how the fuck you gonna pass that up? Eight dollars, right? Boom. So I went on to grab it. Um, again, the the pigmentations on these concealers are freaking bananas. If my camera is blurry, I'm so sorry. Try to be still, but it's not zooming in, focusing. Y'all getting a good look at my skin, bitches. Hi! Yes! yes. <laughs> Too much. I know. Just, I mean, I mean, are you surprised? You shouldn't be. So anyway, definitely the pigmentation on these concealers are off the chain. Um... The price points are spot on. Price points spot on. I have no complaints about no pricing on 
nothing. Y'all, I don't know if it's my eyes is make, that's looking blurry when I'm looking at the screen or my camera is not focusing because I swear it's a blur. But I told y'all I need to go to my eye doctor. But anyway, but yeah, so that's it, y'all. I love you guys. Whoever's been rocking with me, whoever can, keeps coming back watching these crazy ass videos when I do drop, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Like the video, share the video, tell a friend. Go ahead and get Juvia's place. Stop boycotting every damn thing. And let's support our black people. Even though sometimes the businesses ain't doing right. Let's support them. Let's let them know our concerns so they can do better. First of all, let's give them an opportunity to do better. If they don't do better, then boycott. You know what I'm saying? But don't just boycott arbitrarily because we're not boycotting everybody else that's fucking up. You know what I'm saying? So, love you guys. See you in the next video.